Hi, I'm Dr. Richard Gray, a surgical oncologist here at the Mayo Clinic in Arizona. Many women are curious about their genetic risks of developing breast cancer. And many women who have developed breast cancer are curious how their family history or other genetic risks influence their treatment options. These are complex questions and often are best addressed by a multidisciplinary team of breast cancer specialists. When women have a family history that is suggestive of an underlying genetic risk for breast cancer, such as having two or more relatives who developed breast cancer at an age younger than 50, having multiple relatives who developed breast or ovarian cancer, having a relative who at a young age developed breast cancer in both breasts, or those of Ashkenazi Jewish descent or who have a family member that is male and developed breast cancer, those patients are at special genetic risk and may have an underlying genetic mutation such as a BRCA mutation. If you're in that circumstance where you have a strong family history, even if you haven't yet been diagnosed with breast cancer, it's good to seek out a multidisciplinary team of breast specialists who can determine if you should undergo genetic counseling and genetic testing. Having the information of an underlying genetic risk can make a big difference in how you are treated both to prevent future risk of breast cancer as well as if you've already been diagnosed with breast cancer in making sure you have the most effective treatment. Certain treatment options for these women can help prevent a second episode of breast cancer. So if you're in any of those circumstances, seek out a multidisciplinary team of breast cancer specialists like we have at the Mayo Clinic in Arizona. By doing so and asking about how your genetics may influence your treatment and prevention of breast cancer, you can help assure that you have the most effective treatment or the most effective prevention available.